What's up guys? It's your boy. So, in this video, I'm impressed. Very, very impressed. I had a vehicle. Um, I haul a lot of cars that need winched. A lot. Um, uh, but on my trailer, it's difficult to, like, in order to winch it, I put a winch on. I need a bunch of pulleys. So, I need tons of pulleys. And, um, I, I just don't have time right now for the pulleys and all that. So, I was talking to a buddy, and he had told me to go buy this small portable winch. I said, dude, you're crazy. This is an $80 winch we're talking about. He's like, you're crazy. Or I said, you're crazy. He's like, man, I've been using this thing for two or three years. And I haven't had a problem with it. I can move it around. It's portable, whatever. So. Alright, so as I was saying. Sorry, that was uh, my boy Piglet. Prayers are with you, brother. Hope you're alright. Hope Chuck's alright. Um, but he's got a lease. So he's got no worries. Unlike what I did. I just spent a lot of money. But anyway. Um, so this little winch. $79.99 Harbor Freight. Here's the kicker. It says it's a 2,000 pound winch, right? Pulls 2,000 pounds. But it's a marine winch, and when you read it, it says rolling rolling weight, pull weight, 6,500 pounds. So I'm getting ready to show you right now what that winch did. You're gonna be impressed. I was impressed. Check out the video. What's up, guys? All right, I have the ultimate test today. We have a 2,000-pound marine winch. And I'm a car hauler. This winch here says... Here, let's see what it says. All right, so we're going to read it together. Mounting plate, hook. First layer, lines pull, blah, blah, blah. Deadpool, 2,000. Marine pool, 5,000. Rolling stock pool, 6,000. And there's the other dimensions. So we have a 2,000 pound marine winch. Now I have a car hauler and I'm in a jam. I have a load to pick up, but I can't pick, I can't get my winch on because it needs a lot of, like I've got to do a lot of running and I'm in a jam. So here we have the winch. Here we have a probably 6,000 pound Toyota Sequoia. Hit it. Now this winch has pulled this car this far so far. It's pulled it all the way up here. Now, is this ideal everyday use? Probably not. But I'm in a pinch and it'll get me by in the pinch. So, this is a Badlands 20 or a 2,000 pound marine winch. You can hear it working, but it's, it's still working. So, what we're gonna do is try and Still doing what it needs to do, but the problem is now it's both on an incline, so that's why it's you know working like that. But it's still doing what it needs to do. Stop a minute. Still rolling up nicely. Go ahead. And this is just a safety chain. All this came from Harbor Freight. Now, obviously, this winch is, I'm not going to use it to go all the way up, but this, I need this to just get it on the trailer, if that makes sense. So now it's going to fall off and roll a little bit forward right here, and then we're going to move some of this stuff out of the way for it. Here, stop, stop. All right, so when we come back, We'll f show you finishing it. I'm going to clean this up here. All right, guys. So this 2003 back Toyota Sequoia. The, now, the truck is in neutral because we're climbing the incline. Um, like I said, and I've moved my winch up here. This is a 2,000-pound marine winch. Uh, the Badlands. Here. Let's show me winching this up. Go ahead and walk around with me. 
Alright guys, so as you know, this thing's really heavy. So what we had to do is it did get hung up because too much weight. But I just put a, a pulley on it, snatch block, and no problem. I'm impressed. Very, very impressed with this little $80 pocket winch. Now it's slow. Yeah, it's moving it slow, but it's moving it. Alright guys. Finishing up the finishing touches here. Once it gets up and over that, shouldn't be a problem. Again, Badlands 2,000 pound ATV winch. It's definitely not something I would use for this every day. This is in case of a jam. It's the only reason I have it, and this week happens to be a jam. See, so now once this comes over, it should roll a whole lot easier. You see now it's just creeping. But it is moving, it's just creeping. Now you can see it moving a little bit faster. And now I do have a snatch block on it obviously, but it's still, we're working with a 2,000 pound winch here. And it will take me a lot longer than my other winch. But, see what happened there? And now, it should easily, you know, it should roll it up now. But like I said, I, I wouldn't try to get it up to that but that's just what it is so all right guys this is again the badland 2000 pound marine winch coming through in a clutch all right guys so that is a 6200 pound toyota sequoia four-wheel drive loaded up like that thing's heavy i've got tools in it. it's heavy 6200 i'd bet money on it um, heavy big SUV with the incline and you see now it didn't win no races but dude that is impressive an $80 2,000 pound winch just pulled that 6,200 pound SUV up the incline onto my trailer I'm impressed Badlands you make an awesome marine winch now Am I saying replace all your winches with this? No. But I am saying this winch will stay on my truck. Even if I get a big one for the trailer, which I will, this winch will stay with me. Um, I may need to pull something backwards. I, you never know. And for that money, with that winch, it's a no-brainer. So, just a little review on a Badlands winch. 2,000 pound Marine. I'm impressed. Like, share, subscribe. Hit that ding ding. And I will see you tomorrow. Peace.